okay. We have our camp set up in Fruta. I think that's how you say it. So let's walk around the camp. I just talked to the camp host. It's pretty simple. They don't really have... I'm reading that sign right there. We got some very moderate hiking trails around here. So they don't have a real involved process of getting in and getting set up. There's no car permit tag required. There's nothing. They just said there's a scenic loop drive that requires a fee, but we've got the interagency annual pass, so that should be covered. It's really cold here, which is nice because we just came from the desert. We were in Joshua Tree, Red Rock Canyon, Las Vegas, and then Valley of Fire. There's a river right by the campsite. It would have been cool to score a site right by the camp, by the river. There's nothing right up against it, but it's full of mud. It must have must have rained or something, unless that's just a normal color. Anyway, so right now you, you got to have a reservation because everything is booked solid. We scored some reservations that came available just by being diligent and checking the recreation.gov site every day, two or three times a day. So one day this campsite popped up and it was the day we were leaving um, Valley of Fire. So. I didn't really want to come here first because it was going to be such a long drive from Valley of Fire, but it, it, you got to take them like this time of year and not knowing, you know, a year ahead in advance that I'm going to be here, I had to take it. So now we're here, you can get a good look at the campground behind me. Lots of tent campers, lots of people in motorhomes, you got all different kinds. All different kinds of stuff going on people with dogs um, so you get your campsite get set up and that's it and they said just be mindful of the raccoons but we have really good we have really good food discipline anyway we've we've been doing that since we were in New Mexico when we first started our trip There's an empty site right here. It's probably reserved though. And then they've got another loop over there. So there's three loops, if I read the sign right. A, B, and C, we're in loop B. And we scored. All right, fruit to campground. And I'm glad we have I'm glad we have hoodies, cold weather gear, and lots of blankets because I think it's going to be cold. I'm on the edge of this. Look, there's deer. They said all they had here was mule deer as far as big animals go. As you can see, there's deer there, and they said they've already got antlers in, so they don't want you leaving anything hung up overnight in the trees because if the, if the bucks walk through that, then they're going to get tangled up. Here's our campsite right here. We got the, we got the camp already set up. I'm gonna make me some coffee. All right, we're at Fruta and we're established.